Hey guys, it's Rob. Um, alright, so Google Voice. Um, I have a Google Voice number. The link is in the description. Well, no, the number is in the description or whatever. Um, and the way Google Voice works is, is that you have the number and you have it set up so that way it can forward to a number. Now my Google Plus number I have it set up so that way it goes to my cell to one of my cell phones and it also makes the landline ring. Um, so the landline is its own number and the cell phone has its own number so technically the cell phone and the landline have two numbers associated to it the actual number and the Google Plus number so the Google Plus calls the actual number for the cell phone or the landline um, so anyways um, <coughs> now Google Plus uh, has this the setting so you can have certain times of the day or night where um, it goes to do not disturb <clears throat> so if you call my Google Voice number between uh, 9 p.m. and 9 a.m. the f uh, neither of the phones ring it, go, it go, just goes right straight to voicemail. <coughs> so, last night, when I went to bed at, uh, like, 10.30, um, I just went to bed, and I didn't get woken up by Joseph Martelli calling me seven or eight times in the middle of the night. So, apparently that makes me a pussy that makes me too afraid to pick up the phone when uh, I didn't even know he was calling me because uh, you know um, uh, 10 well the last time he called me was at like 11 50 at night. Yeah, you know, people, people, people like to sleep. Um, and I have this do not disturb on, uh, for a reason. You know, because on Monday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, I'm watching the Drunken Peasants, and I stay up, um, until about one o'clock at night on those nights um, sometimes I can't even sometimes I can't even actually stay awake long enough to finish the show and I have to watch it the next day um, you know so you know oh but I, I'm a push it because I didn't answer the phone even though I didn't know he was calling so yeah anyways you know, I wonder how he would feel, you know, if people just called him all the time. You know, you know, it's funny because, like, any time that I call or text him, he bitches me out. You know, but, uh, it's perfectly okay for him to, you know, call and text me all, whenever he wants, even late at night. You know, way, whatever. So, yeah. You know, he has like this he has like these Google Plus pages where he has like all these photos of me and uh, uh Karuna Satori SMR and um all kinds of other weird screen caps and stuff with like words written on them and all this other like really crazy looking bullshit, but hey, whatever. He's you know we're the stalkers, um, just because we're talking about somebody who is interfering with our lives and, like, you know, 
uh, getting getting programs that we watch, DMs, you know, uh, giving them trouble and stuff like that. Because, you know, I was willing to completely leave him alone until this DMCA bullshit happened, and now I'm just pretty much responding to him doing shit to me, you know, and <laughs> it's just like, leave me alone, and leave other people alone, and they'll leave you alone, but it just, it's this endless cycle of him harassing people, and then, you know, people pushing back against him, and so on and so forth, and it's just like, oh my gosh, it's got to, it's, ugh, it's been three years of this crap, you know, so, and it goes in cycles, too. I don't want to spend all fucking summer, you know, fighting against this guy and, and, you know, like, having him call me, you know, and, you know, not wanting to deal with him and then not making me sound like a fucking pussy and a bitch and all that other bullshit. Yeah, so anyways, whatever. Bye.